The money part is among the most exciting, yet also the turkiest aspects of running an online store. As an e-commerce business owner, you rely on smooth and secure payment transactions to keep your operations running smoothly. However, payment disputes can arise, causing headaches and potential financial losses. Resolving these disputes effectively lets you maintain a positive customer experience and protect your business's bottom line. In this video, we will explore various solutions and strategies to help online store owners confidently navigate payment disputes and minimize their impact on their business. From proactive measures to prevent disputes to practical steps for resolution, we'll provide you with valuable insights and actionable tips to master payment disputes and keep your online store thriving. Let's get started. Now, what exactly are payment disputes? Payment disputes refer to conflicts or disagreements that arise between the buyer and seller regarding a payment transaction. These disputes can occur for various reasons, such as issues with product quality, delivery delays, incorrect charges, or unauthorized transactions. When a customer raises a payment dispute, it typically initiates a process that involves reviewing the transaction details investigating the claim, and reaching a resolution that satisfies both parties. For online store owners, payment disputes can be tricky to navigate. They can disrupt cash flow, strain customer relationships, and potentially result in financial losses. This is why it's a must for sellers to understand the nature of payment disputes and be prepared to address them effectively. Payment disputes can manifest in different forms, each with its own unique characteristics and resolution processes. Here are some common types of payment disputes that online store owners may encounter. This is what most people think of when talking about payment disputes. A chargeback occurs when customer disputes a charge with their credit card issuer. The customer claims the charge was unauthorized or fraudulent, or did not receive the promised goods or services. The bank or credit card issuer then investigates the claim and may reverse the transaction, refunding the customer's money. That's right, PayPal has its own dispute resolution process. Customers can open a dispute through their PayPal account, citing reasons such as non-delivery, items not as described, or unauthorized transactions. PayPal mediates the dispute between the buyer and seller and makes a final decision based on the provided evidence. These disputes arise when customers question the accuracy of charges on their invoices or receipts. They may notice discrepancies in pricing, shipping fees, or additional charges that were not disclosed or agreed upon during the purchase process. Finances will always be a serious concern, not just to sellers like you, but especially to your shoppers. This is why proactive payment dispute management is a must. By proactively addressing and resolving payment disputes, you can provide a seamless and secure shopping experience for your customers. Here are a few more reasons why proactive payment dispute management matters. When shoppers know that their concerns and disputes will be handled efficiently and fairly, they are likelier to trust your online store and make purchases without hesitation. Building customer confidence in your payment processes helps establish long-term relationships and encourages repeat business. Payment disputes can have a significant financial impact on your online store. Chargebacks and refunds can cause revenue loss and additional costs associated with dispute resolution. By proactively managing your payment disputes, you can minimize the financial impact by resolving issues before they escalate and implementing strategies to prevent disputes in the first place. Your reputation as an online store is crucial to your success. Word spreads quickly in the digital age, and negative experiences with payment disputes can damage your brand image and deter potential customers. By actively managing and resolving disputes, you can maintain a positive reputation and position your store as trustworthy and reliable. Effective payment dispute management ensures compliance with industry regulations and reduces the risk of legal complications. When you follow established procedures and maintain accurate records of dispute resolutions, you can mitigate the risk of legal disputes and potential penalties associated with non-compliance. Got a payment dispute? Fret not. This doesn't mean it's the end of the world for your online store. Payment disputes can happen for various reasons, but you can effectively manage and resolve them with the right approach and proactive steps. Here's how you can do so with some of the most popular e-commerce platforms. 
Receiving a chargeback on your Etsy shop can be a frustrating experience, but there are actions you can take to address it. First, carefully review the chargeback notification and gather any relevant evidence, such as order details, communication with the customer, and proof of shipment. Respond promptly to the chargeback by providing the required documentation through Etsy's Resolution Center. Be prepared to present a strong case that demonstrates you fulfilled your obligations as a seller. Stay in communication with Etsy and follow their guidelines throughout the process to increase your chances of a successful resolution. The process for Shopify is quite similar to Etsy's. However, Shopify advises taking a slightly different approach by contacting the customer first. When you receive a payment dispute, it's important to promptly address the issue by contacting the customer directly. Open a dialogue with the customer to find a mutually agreeable resolution. This may involve clarifying any misunderstandings, offering a refund or replacement, or providing additional assistance to resolve their concerns. You can involve Shopify's support team if direct communication fails to resolve the dispute. Provide them with a detailed account of the issue, including all the relevant information and supporting evidence. Shopify's support team will work with you and the customer to mediate the dispute and find a fair solution. As for WooCommerce, there are three actions you can take when you got a payment dispute case. This one technically means you're also accepting the dispute as the dispute will be marked lost once the deadline arrives. You may simply choose this option if you think the dispute is valid. This expedites the processing of dispute you've accepted. This involves refunding the customer or resolving the issue to satisfy both parties. By accepting the dispute, you can avoid further complications and maintain a positive customer relationship. If you believe the dispute is unwarranted or have evidence to support your case, you can challenge the dispute. This involves gathering all relevant information such as order details, customer communication, and transaction records to present a compelling argument against the dispute. You can then submit this evidence to your payment provider or the relevant financial institution for review. Remember that challenging a dispute requires careful documentation and adherence to specific guidelines provided by your payment provider or financial institution. Of course, as much as possible, any seller would want to avoid payment disputes and ensure smooth transactions. Here are several proactive steps you can take to prevent payment disputes from occurring in the first place. Selecting a trustworthy and reputable payment gateway provider is crucial. Look for providers with robust security measures, fraud detection systems, and reliable dispute resolution processes. Research and compare different options to find the best fit for your business. Clearly and accurately describe your products or services on your website or online store. Include all relevant information such as size, color, specifications, and any potential limitations or requirements. This helps manage customer expectations and reduces the likelihood of misunderstandings or disputes regarding the purchased items. Establish transparent and concise return and refund policies. Clearly outline the conditions, timeframes, and procedures for returns and refunds. Make sure your policies are easily accessible and visible to your website or during the checkout process. By setting clear expectations, you can minimize the chances of disputes arising from customer dissatisfaction. Provide responsive customer support and multiple communication channels for your customers to reach out to you. Make it easy for them to ask questions, seek clarifications, or resolve any concerns they may have. Timely and effective communication can help address potential issues before they even escalate into disputes. Some disputes arise from unfulfilled orders. Thus, regularly update your inventory and promptly remove any discontinued or out-of-stock items from your website or online store. Clearly indicate the availability status of products to prevent customers from making purchases they cannot receive. Stay vigilant and watch out for any suspicious or fraudulent orders. Look for red flags such as unusually large orders, multiple transactions from the same customer, or inconsistent shipping and billing information. Implement fraud detection tools or services to help identify potential fraudulent activity and protect your business. I hope this quick guide has provided valuable insights and strategies for effectively managing payment disputes. Remember, payment disputes are an inevitable part of running an online store. But by being proactive and taking the necessary steps to prevent and resolve them, you can minimize their impact on your business. Stay informed, stay vigilant, and prioritize open communication with your customers to maintain a positive shopping experience for all parties involved. 
With these practices in place, you'll be better equipped to navigate the challenges of payment disputes and ensure the success and growth of your online store. For more e-commerce tips and tricks, check out our channel. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more useful tips and guides to get you started selling with awkward styles. Is there something that we haven't covered yet? Let us know in the comments below. See you next time.